A typical board meeting for me is usually a two-day event. Um, and it can begin with breakfast, 8 o'clock in the morning. Then what usually happens is we'll break into committee meetings. Committees can be things like the audit committee. I serve on one of those. I also serve on compensation committees, nominating and governance committees, the types of committees where we bring new people onto the board. So we'll have committee meetings the first day, catch up as a, a governance team, have a dinner with management where we get to talk about issues that are going on for the business and prepare for the next day. And then the next day we generally go in and it's full board meeting, meaning all board members are in the same room. And we typically cover some very important topics. As a board member, the most important thing that you do in your role is you help management. The board is a guide and a leader to the management team. You're ultimately a fiduciary, which means that you're responsible for producing returns for the stockholders, the people that own the company. They're the ones that you're really working for. At the same time, you have to balance that with the needs of your customers. You have to balance that with the needs of your employees. And you have to do all of that in a way that um, is compliant. So we really focus on strategy and risk in the plans that we're looking at and, and try to do everything that we can to help management really achieve those objectives that make people's lives better. After a board meeting or a long trip where I've been out, you know, working on investments, that kind of thing, um, getting home is such a luxury. I, I live in the woods of northern Massachusetts, and I love the serenity and quiet of that because generally where I go for business is going to be very large metropolitan centers, which I also love. But the ability to have that balance in both of those things in my life is really important. And, and one of the things that I think I focused on a lot, as, as, as you get older, you'll hear people talk to you about time management and how important that is and how you have so many competing priorities. That's the world that we live in today. We are a 24-7 world. I have found the most effective time management technique to be wherever you are, be there. Don't be distracted by thinking about what's going to happen tomorrow, or if you're at home and relaxing because you've earned it, then let go for a day. You know, recharge your batteries. When you go back into that board meeting, you go back in and you be 100%. Wherever you are, be there. That's the best time management technique, I think.